What's up everybody, Greg Adela here. Time again for my weekly Wednesday update, but it's Thursday, July 15, 2021. I couldn't get to my Wednesday update yesterday because of my schedule and all that biblical rain that we had here. Uh, so much rain, I'm pretty sure I saw an ark floating down the street. Uh, that said, thanks for bearing with me and understanding. Uh, right out of the gate, I wanna thank everyone over the last week uh, for spreading my message of positivity for your donations and all your kind uh, words of encouragement. Thank you very much. Uh, I am standing here today on the corner of Quail and First across the street from headquarters, our family business. And right here, uh, my friend Greg Sheldon, uh, who runs the Victory Gardens here, they, they've purchased this plot and they've really done some really great stuff here, as you can see, flowers, brick pavers, um, really good stuff that's gonna be here uh, for the community uh, and to give back. And we're really trying to work uh, as a team here in West Hill to beautify it. So I'm very thankful to Greg and, and his great uh, staff of volunteers, his wife, his kid, everyone. They, they really work uh, hard. Uh, and, and they're very positive, which is great. Uh, that said, just wanted to let you know uh, what we're gonna be doing here uh, next Wednesday, the 22nd. There's gonna be a, a block party here, right? It's from five to 10, it's open to the public. Um, I'll be uh, here, uh, meet and greet for a couple hours from five to seven. And this is gonna be awareness uh, with, with the violence that's been happening. Uh, there's a family here that had uh, a son uh, that um, passed away due to the violence uh, within the past year. And we're trying to raise awareness and bring more uh, community effort here. So I'm really excited about that. So I hope you can stop down. Again, that's Wednesday the 22nd, and that's 5 to 10 p.m. Uh, people want to know, I will be having press conferences coming up in the next three weeks, uh, laying out more of my plan uh, for the city of Albany. I'm excited about that. Um, until then, uh, listen, I've said it from day one, I'm very accessible. Uh, that's why I'm the independent candidate. I want to be beholden to the people of Albany and not a political affiliation. If you have any questions and you want to meet with me, I'd be glad to meet you and answer any questions uh, that you might have and concerns for the city of Albany. I can be reached at greg at gregformayor2021.com. If you'd like to donate to my campaign, that is also very helpful. And you can do that by going to my website at gregformayor2021.com. All right, folks, that's it for this week's update. Uh, listen, it's beautiful weather. I hope you can get out and enjoy it. I hope uh, the, the rain uh, stays away uh, from us here for a little while. And also a quick note, remember up in Saratoga, our friends up in Saratoga, the track's opening uh, today. Uh, so I hope uh, you can take a little trip sometime, go up and support our friends in Saratoga and the track and, and the beautiful uh, uh, city that Saratoga is. So until next time, stay healthy, stay safe and stay positive. I'll see you soon, everybody.